गुड मॉर्निंग इन ओम शांति एंड वेलकम बैक टू योर ओन चैनल सी द सोल द ट्रूथ लाइज विद इन और दोज हुव कम फॉर द फर्स्ट टाइम फॉर यू देर इज अ कम्प्लीट लिंक डाउन बिलो विच टेक्स यू टू द प्ले लिस्ट ऑफ दिस चैनल वे यू कैन एक्सप्लोर डिप्रेशन टॉपिक्स एंड यू कैन शेयर इट विद दोज पीपल होम यू फील दे नीड दैट हेल्प विद डिवोर्स केसेज विद पेरेंटिंग विद ब्रेकअप्स यू कैन शेयर ऑल दीज वीडियो विद योर क्लोज पीपल एंड रिलेटिव एंड इफ यू नीड सो यू कैन ऑल्सो एन्जॉय दैम एंड अंडरस्टैंड एंड लर्न फ्रॉम दैम and not just that there is yoga asanas there is flexibility there is sleep at night how to sleep well diet everything is there in this channel have a look and if you like something do share it with others and help them out in their life let's go ahead with today's blessing now today's blessing is 245th of our blessing let's see what is baba want us to change in our life so as to bring about a change in everybody else's life Baba says, "May you have an intellect filled with faith, and transform the sanskars. Sanskars means habits of all souls with your benevolent feelings. We want people to change around us, right? We want the children to change. We want our parents to change. We want our family members to change. We want the wife to change. We want the husband to change. We want the kids to change. Everybody wants somebody to change. An employer wants the employee to change. Everybody is expecting somebody to change something so that their work gets done or their life becomes simpler. Well." Here is the method. Let's get into the details. Your intellect has hundred percent faith in the Father, right? God Father. We have hundred percent faith in God the Father, so that no matter how much someone tries to shake you, someone tries to tell you, "Prama Kumari is is all about leaving this food item. Don't eat this. Don't eat that. Don't wear this. Don't wear that. Don't talk like this. Don't talk like that." How much can somebody do? One one has to live their life, right? But there are practical and there are completely logical reasoning behind why all that has been told to us that you may leave these by choice not by force brahma kumaris is an organization which doesn't force you it's your choice leave it try it and then go ahead with it make a choice but experience first without experience you can't question why should i leave this food item leave it and see so god says same way no matter how much someone tries to shake you you have love for the father and you understand that the supreme being is guiding you telling you what to do what not to do so when you have love for the father in meditation when you have experienced that love and peace and energy then you are ready to do anything right you are ready to leave anything for any person same here so people will shake you don't do build don't do like this why are you following brahma kumari brahma kumari is like this they are very strong they are this they change your religion no nothing is changed you become more religious as a person now what is being religious we learn it at brahma kumaris so in the same way no matter what type of paper souls in the divine family what type of paper paper means a test paper souls in the divine family or in the worldly community give you divine family means even amongst the brahma kumaris since we are all students we are trying to overcome anger ego jealousy and so many things but we are not 100% come over it right to overcome it so somebody could get angry and that person could be from the spiritual brahma kumaris family now what to do you will see that circumstance from other people who are not into knowledge who are not into spirituality they can get angry they can get egoistic they can get jealous now but now a family member of prema kumari is from a divine family wearing white clothes is getting angry how is that possible now how do you treat that how do you express your in a turmoil when you see something like that god says everything over here baba says even if they get angry who divine family or the worldly family worldly family who are not into this knowledge so even if they get angry and oppose you insult you or defame you they cannot shake you why because in this spirituality also if i am somebody who's stronger than the other person who's also student of spirituality i'll go ahead in life i'll become more powerful and stronger there are no marks in it god gives the final marks there are no physical marks over here that you have scored 10 points because you didn't get angry you have scored 20 points because you didn't get angry no but the peace which you feel is the marks which you attain is the strength is the power which you feel that is your self marking so baba says yes they can also get angry divine family members then what do you do for the simply have benevolent feelings for all souls and these feelings will transform their sanskars having benevolent feelings means not replying back not shouting back not insulting them back not defaming them back no if you do that they have sinned you have also sinned 
they'll give you 10 more replies they'll be sending you more 10 times you'll be giving 10 more replies imagine the amount of sin which is increasing tenfold multifold don't do that papa says have benevolent feelings may the soul have peace may the soul have power to realize may the soul have more of patience more of tolerance whatsoever they need in terms of knowledge or values or virtues then papa says you mustn't become impatient in this it's been one year i've been giving good wishes i've been having good wishes i've been tolerating so much now how much should i tolerate well that is their sanskar of intolerance your sanskar or habit of tolerance is your own what will you take with you not the wealth around you but the sanskar of tolerance is what is going to go with you as a soul in the next life next birth or in param dham so baba says you mustn't become impatient in this fruit will definitely emerge at the right time they will change this is fixed in the drama situations will make them change if you're not able to make them change by your tolerance or patience something is going to knock them out in their life some situation is going to come the ego is going to reduce some situation is going to come the anger is going to reduce that is fixed in the drama when god is giving that guarantee that every child of mine will become pure and come up so who are we to question that i am not god i cannot take the law into my hand god is taking care of that child i just need to practice patience i don't need to actually aggravate their anger or aggravate their frustration by replying back or getting more angry with them god is said patience good feelings good wishes for them no replying back no anger don't increase that because you are not helping them to come out of anger not helping them to come out of ego not helping helping them to come out of that kind of habit by becoming the same the way they are so change when we change that's what we learned they will change what change not replying back not insulting them back patience tolerance acceptance how do you do that that can only happen when you're meditating with god patience comes tolerance comes just knowledge doesn't make you patient just knowledge doesn't make you somebody who's got more tolerance but meditation godly power helps you how do you do that you can learn it at brahma kumari's institution it's a university for free for all in 150 countries you can come and learn that for free and have a blessed day and if you have any comments if you have experienced something like this do share it over here and share it with others stay healthy stay safe from shanti Thank you.